Hello and welcome to the tutorial team. This is Monty251 bringing you a quick tutorial. This is going to be in Sony Vegas. It's a carry on from the tutorial earlier where you got to make a 3D text which looked something like this. So when you have your 3D text you might want to add some pictures into the back of it, the background or around it. So what you basically do is let's say you're a big iPhone iPod touch freak so you drag a picture in this is a picture of an apple and as you can see the picture has placed itself behind now if you want that in front which you probably wouldn't because then it would cover the text you just basically drag that video track above the video track for your 3D text motion and that will be uh, in front of it to change the the size of it size of it etc go to event pan uh, forward slash crop and it'll open up this now to make it smaller what you need to do is pull it outwards like this and as you'll see on the preview screen it does get smaller okay and then that, that means you can also move it you can place it here okay and exit out of that and you can play that and as you can see the 3d text twirls around over overlaying the image you can add as many uh, pictures as you want let's add a picture of my gaming setup as you can see that one has uh, came in and it is absolutely massive so event pan crop is a very good function for this kind of picture you can also twist it around sideways make it a diagonal picture so that's like this quite small I'll move it up here and as you can see that picture slots in nicely there just like that this means you can create an absolutely brilliant intro along with that 3d text these pictures make an intro look absolutely brilliant so once more drag the picture into the video track as you can see it's very big event pan crop scroll out just to make it easier to work with and drag that outwards and then just basically base your picture wherever you want it like this okay now that does give a very good effect it's a lot better than just a black screen so what I'm gonna do now is actually show you this uh, quick intro in action uh, just now so here you are as you can see this uh, background is very effective for for your 3D text in the back of it. Uh, so thanks for watching the tutorial and stay tuned for more and make sure to subscribe. Cheers.